Hey y'all, Kurt Sauser here from TGT Web Comics at C2E2 with one of my favorite guys here, Joel Watson from Hijinx and Sue. How you doing today, Joel? Doing pretty good, Kurt. What's going on? I'm surviving a con, my first one here, and uh, you're looking uh, you're looking pretty good there. I'm uh, I'm beat. Day three and uh, only a day's worth of sleep. Well, you know, you, you know, hijink and Sue, this is your love, this is your your passion. You, you you're doing this full time, and it's great to see that you're at C2E2. Here. I'm enjoying it, man. It's been a good show. It, uh, I'm surprised for a first year show that it's well put together and has a good turnout. That's kind of a shock. So it's been a surprise, but a good one. Well, you know, you have book book one here, and you know, I've always enjoyed your work. You know, we had you on the podcast. You, you talked at great length about your process, and it's still the one of the most downloaded episodes on TG2 and I can't thank you enough for doing that one but talk to us about book one what's in it uh, the book com- uh, compiles the first two years of comics from hijinks and Sue, and then also new directors sort of artist commentary on every comic behind the scenes stuff and uh, really embarrassing crap that I drew in middle school and high school is terrible terrible superheroes I made up and, and now every everything you've drawn is is your own style we you know we, we've seen it before and you know we have George Lucas put the lights ever just had that's personally one of my favorites um, you know you have the aliens you, you're truly a sci-fi um, comic artist personified and to make it fit your own comedy style and you know I really appreciate all the hard work you put into it well thanks man um, I, I, I try and go for that particular geek that is uh, into the same uh, you know geekness that I am uh, and, and there seems to be enough of them out there so no C2E2 is just is, is a large convention and it's you know as I said it's good to see you here but you know when everything closes up when you finally pack up your amazing shirts that you have here your prints and everything like that what are you personally going to take away from it uh, a little envelope full of money or it's I mean it's it's kind of big now but uh, that's it okay <laughs> what are you going to share then with the people that ask you how was C2E2 I'll count my money when I get back to the hotel and then I'll be able to gauge that response better. Alrighty. Uh, well, you know, you've had about a day's worth of sleep, as you said, and I, I really don't want to take up too much more uh, of your time. Fine. But you know, you're, you're here with Gordon from Multiplex. You yeah. know, how's he's how's this? <laughs> he's a he's just a right cock. I hate that guy. God. You really? I mean, a working burden. a burden. They should call him Bor- Burden McAlpin. I think he's reaching on that one. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Funny, funny. I'm delirious <laughs> with, with lack of sleep. This is a great time to ask him questions then, I guess. Yeah, no, it is. It is. You should ask me things that I wouldn't normally be honest about. Who knows? It's like it's, I'm going to have a, a sodium pentothal effect right now. So really, is that your real hair? Yeah, I might I might tell you where uh, where the bodies are hidden. I don't know. Jimmy Hoffa, you you know him? Man, where are we? Isn't it isn't he buried here somewhere? <laughs> Underneath this con, perhaps? I'm not sure. Well, you heard it here first. Jeremy Hoffa could be under C2E2. Dig now. But, oh. uh, you know, it's been a great time chatting with you, Joel. Is there any other projects you have coming down the pipe that you'd like to share with us? Uh, hopefully by, I, let's say, June or July, book two should be up for pre-order. I hope. I have to write it first. And that's something that uh, I should start on three months ago. So... What about sketches? How have your sketches gone for today? Um, I only do, uh, at these cons, I typically only do sketches in the book. Oh. Um, that's, norm- that's normally all I'm ever asked to do, so uh, let's see if I've done any weird ones. Um, you're, you're trying to access a part of my memory that's like up to 24 hours in the past, and it's just not happening, so. That's all right. Well, we'll let you get back to the con here, Joel. I really appreciate you taking the yeah. time to do this interview. And what's the website for those that don't know it? Hijinksinsue.com, spelled uh, the way that you would think it's not spelled. <laughs> With the silent K. Yeah, no, just uh, Google that. Google some, some way of spelling that, and you'll find it. All right, Joel. Thank you very much, and I really appreciate you taking the time. Thanks, Kurt.